hello everyone welcome to our sun wife today i wanted to do a quick video on why we need to wait until the last frost date for a couple of our baby plants to be transplanted this is an example um we had a highs of actually say, close to 68 or so but the lower was 28 28 meaning it actually falls under the 32 degrees the frost temperature basically all the water or the dew drops which were on the plants on the leaves will get converted will be frozen into ice which heavily impacts the baby plants this is grass it always comes back to normal but consider if this is a regular tomato plant or some eggplant or the okra that will get frozen and the leaves would get damaged once the leaf get damaged the plant the survival of the baby plant would be really tough this is my strawberry patch this will come back and uh, you can see the ice on the uh, leaves so do wait until the last frost date of your zone uh, the easiest way is to check in the google check you know for your zip code what is the last frost date and wait until then to transplant non-cold crops cold crops you can transplant example is kale i did uh, plant the kale and it will survive throughout the frost and snow and, and for more informative videos click that subscribe button and let me know your questions in the comments or if you have any compliments leave that one too i would love to hear from you you all have an awesome life happy and healthy gardening